Hello everybody, hope you guys are having a fantastic day. I have been having a crazy day today. I went through a few listings with my buyers and I have to say there is first of all not enough listing on the market and whatever is showing as listed, not everything is available that you are uh, going through. So when by the time I call the realtors, the home is under um, contract or they are already sold. So it makes it half of the homes there is on the market that are being available right now then you are seeing about 30 to 40 groups going through each listings and then you have uh, multiple offers going in so if you're a buyer who's putting in the uh, price that is an asking price you might not get it and um, uh, but you can definitely try and I will say that uh, right now the trend is showing that you are putting an offer in which is uh, uh, from asking price to as high as 50000 or even more for a townhome. When we're looking at a single family houses, the prices are anywhere from 80000 to uh, 150000 more than asking price. So uh, that is um, that is a budget that you want to keep in mind when you are working with an approved number, whatever your ceiling maximum uh, approval is at you want to reverse the number and say that okay if i've got approved for six hundred thousand i'm going to work with five hundred fifty thousand that's the listing price i'm going to go with go and look at homes in that kind of pricing because that gives you the buffer to move up the price to put a place in offer now for uh, all the buyers as well i would advise you guys go and look at a lot of builders products because developers are putting a price out there for you and then those are set price for you you're not doing no bidding offer and once the home is uh, sold, I mean, uh, spoken to you, that home is spoken to you of, so the, uh, the, uh, the salespeople are not going to sell that same home to somebody else, at least till the developer accepts the offer, that offer is only under your name. It's much, much more security for you to do that with a developer. And also you get being sold at the current market value and uh, you don't need to worry about anything uh, after you write an offer. You have that seven day rescind period. So if you are in a show home, showroom, make sure you make an offer before you leave because if you say that you're gonna think about it and return next day to write an offer, you might not get the same location or even the same price because prices are changing daily or weekly, I would say. But uh, at this point, my advice to you would be work with that and um, hope uh, this helps you make the right decision for yourself. If you need any help with the real estate or mortgages, give me a call.